If you find yourself with a camera in your hand and want to learn how to use it, please subscribe to this channel, like the videos, comment below. Hey Photos family, today we're talking about strobes and I'm going to give you a little bit of a demonstration around another strobe that I have, which is a very small, they call umbrella strobe. But the, uh, the small nature of it makes it very portable. This one does not have a modeling lamp, so I can't show you that, but the power button back here turns on the strobe and I will show you what the test looks like in a second here with some of the light modifiers that we have for it. For instance, when the strobe goes off, there's a test button back here near the power button. Right there, there's the power and that is the test button. You're gonna see the flash go off and that is the strobe ring inside that's actuating. Very bright. <laughs> All right, so um, these, uh, these lights don't have an option of turning off any um, notification or beeping that it is regenerated and has actuated one strobe. However, there is a place under here for the umbrella to insert under that light. There are many different umbrella styles and this one for instance has a cover. Pull that off and you can open it up just like a rain umbrella and open it up. Put together the umbrella with the light. It has a little pressure sensitive connection in there and I just bumped my camera. There we go. With the umbrella and the strobe connected together. Now, pull back here. You will see the strobe can be placed as close or as far away from the umbrella as necessary and actuate that strobe. So that is how the umbrella opens and connects to the light, as well as the little detail tour we got around the strobe itself. When you do have a two-prong bulb in the center, which acts as a modeling light, you can turn that modeling light lamp on with that power switch right there. Here's a fuse to replace. If your light isn't working, you need a three amp fuse, and it runs between 110 and 130 volts. That uh, little connector right there is your sink cable that you can run between one of these umbrella strobes to this one so that they both flash together and you can have a unified lighting system from two or more umbrella strobes as long as you have a splitter to go from one to the next. The other handy issue is I believe all of these uh, umbrella strobes have this little sensor on top so that your camera can actuate these umbrella strobes all at the same time with that one little optical sensor. I have used the optical sensor together. I've also tied the umbrella strobes together with other strobes, studio strobes, to be able to connect them all together all at the same time and light the photograph every actuation up to about 200 or 250th of a second. Uh, 1 200th or 1 250th of a second. Let me say it all complete in total uh, correctly entirely. The last thing to show you on this umbrella strobe is this is the intensity uh, uh, dial. It's all the way up at this point. You can turn it all the way down. And this one is just, uh, what would that be, like 7 eighths of a turn? So it goes from that part of the white line all the way up and stops at the most bold side of the uh, intensity. Unlike the other JTLs I've shown in other videos, which keeps going until the light indicators go all the way up. This has no light indicator, so it just goes from the, the most thin side of the line to the most bold. And I'll give you a little bit of a, an idea here how that changes the intensity slightly into the camera in a way. It's still very bright, but you might have noticed that it's slightly less intense, but it still has the power necessary to light a photograph with the camera being uh, possibly used at a very fast shutter speed at a relatively low ISO setting or even a fairly um, opened up aperture so that the change of exposure with all three of those settings at its most uh, narrowed down for light intensity. These umbrella strobes, as small as they are, still have the intensity needed. Thank you so much for watching. God bless.